Hello all of my little baby bunnies. My name is Karen with Karen and Bob Gaming and we are playing the Sandbox Alpha of the Long Dark. Um, so this is a game that I, uh, I've i put quite a bit of time into and I'm not going to make this into a series or anything because I don't feel like I could make that watchable, but I did want to just do at least one video where I kind of talk to how the how the game works and why it's fun as shit to play because I believe I've clocked uh, according to Steam 37 hours on this game already so let's do this thing um trailer I don't even remember where I left off okay I fucking don't remember how I'm supposed to play okay so I'm a little tired I'm not cold okay I'm good on calories Okay, so basically, this is a survival game. Um, the story is supposed to go... What do I even... Oh, they've updated this. This is pretty. Wow, I haven't played this in a while. Damn, dude, this is nice. I don't even know what half of this shit is. <laughs> um, okay, cool. Oh, I'm over. Oh, shit, I'm over. I need to drop stuff. What if I don't want to drop stuff? Oh, no. Oh no. This is awful. Okay, so it's a survival game. Um, this just means I'm gonna walk slowly. So, uh, or I can't run, rather. So, it's a survival game. The story is, it's not released in story mode yet, obviously, since it's an alpha. But, basically, it's supposed to be that you, oh, I did drop a lot of stuff. <laughs> Look at that. Um, it's supposed to be that you were on a plane and it crashed in uh, Canada, I think, which is why it's cold and the, why it's called the long dark, which is also why you have all this like temperature stuff and clothing, warmth bonuses and whatever. Because uh, I'll be frank, this game is hard. Um, it is not not easy at all. I survived not even a day the first time um i played it and uh i think i've gotten to what day is it now what is it like day 20 i don't even know i don't know what i'm talking about <laughs> don't listen to a word i say <laughs> okay um all right so no storm right now oh i see are there wolves nearby i mean i saw that one okay so i can sleep in there if i need to those little wood thing the who's and if I remember correctly there's no map yeah yep no map which is awful for a person like me I get lost so easily all right I'm gonna go back in there because it's safer in there and I'm gonna take a look at um, my inventory is was there a uh, there was not Fuck. Okay, there's no place to light a fire here, which means I can't cook food. Let me look at, um, equipment. Can I look at, is this food? Yes, okay. So, this is almost, I'm over by five kilograms. So this is 1.1. 1. 1. Oh damn, none of these weigh a lot. Ten of coffee. Okay, it'll make me warm. It won't even do anything else. Safe to drink. I, yeah, I've killed wolves and I cooked their meat. Um, where's my uh, hunger? Hunger is decent. I could probably eat though. Let me get rid of one of my meats. <laughs> done. Da done. Da done. Um. Oh, and it takes time to do everything. I forgot. Oh my god. Sometimes when you're like outside and you're trying to skin an animal that you've killed, uh, you'll freeze to death because it takes time for you to do that. <laughs> it's a pain in the ass. I wish I'd actually played through this a little bit before I started this video. I'm smart. Either way, uh, you can get injured from falls or from attacking animals and you would use all these things to heal yourself. Uh, your clothing will disintegrate after some time, and as it loses its durability, um, it will be less effective. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, I think I've made... 
a couple of things with, yeah, I've made a wolf skin coat. Am I wearing this? Yes, I'm wearing this. I made, no, I didn't make that. But you can, if you have like a sewing kit, you can improve the durability of your shit. But sewing kits you just find, like they're not, uh, you can't make a sewing kit. You just find it, which makes things really hard because you have a finite map to search through. What am I looking at? Matches? Those don't weigh anything. Crowbar is useful. These don't weigh anything. A flare is very useful. Loud enough to scare- Ooh, that's useful. I didn't know that. Hatchet. I need that for wood. Um, do I have any bullets? I don't even know if I have any bullets! <laughs> okay. What is this? Cloth. Gut. Oh, crafting. Crafting and repair. I forgot. You can, I guess you can use it to sew stuff. Leather. Alright, so this is all stuff that I'd use to, um, make things. Okay. Let's go back. Oh, I'm thirsty. I should drink. Well, I'm not- technically I'm not really that thirsty. But I'm sort of thirsty. Is that all I have? Okay, I guess I drink enough until I'm, um, not thirsty anymore. Okay. Oh, I don't remember, like, really where I left off when I, uh, <laughs> when I exited the game last, um, clearly. So I'm a little scared to- oh shit, that wolf is kind of close. So there's, like, a funny disclaimer at the beginning of the game that says, uh, yes, the game developers know that wildlife don't normally attack humans, blah blah blah. <laughs> um... So they're very like, oh gosh, that makes me really nervous. Is there any, okay, so there's a few little places I can hang out at. There's one over there. Is that a, is that a wolf? Oh, that's a house, cool. Okay, so this is really all this game is, is you explore, you find stuff, you make stuff, and you try not to die. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, I inhaled something that I shouldn't have. <coughs> something besides air. I think that's a dead animal. Okay. Um, am I crouching or am I just really low to the ground? I'm just really low to the ground. Okay. Um, so, yeah, at the moment, no story mode, just sandbox. So all you can really do is just try to live and not die and whatever the fuck. Um... But it's very, very fun and really addicting. Once you figure out the mechanic, um, it's awesome. It's super awesome. And as you can see, it's quite pretty. Like, it's it's not designed to be um, super realistic or anything, but it but it is pretty. Um, oh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, here we go. Oh, yeah, I've left stuff in here. I have totally been here before. <laughs> Nothing in there. Best be prepared for yes, anything. Yes, ma'am. Oh yeah, that's useful. I can turn that into tinder. Um, where is my um? I don't have a reticle. I thought I did. That's making things really confusing. Can I go fishing? Can I fish? Do I actually have a bedroll? I didn't think I did. Um, let me look. Tools. Yeah, I know you're cold, girl. Fishing tackle. Yes, I can go fishing. Oh, but I need to um, I need to hibbity hoo. I need to do this. I have to break it open with my hatchet. And of course now it's gonna be night time. Wolves, please stay away. <laughs> do not attack me. That would be appreciated. Okay, so now I can fish. Um, I will fish for... I'm gonna do one hour, just to be safe, because I don't know how cold I'm gonna get. Because you can absolutely freeze to death. It's terrifying. Um, let me start a fire. Oh, yeah, they've really changed that around. Okay, let's... Whoa. Whoa, I'm scared. What what just happened with that? 100%, 100%. Okay, either way. I think when plugs way more? I don't remember. Hang on, I'm going to go back and check. I like to use what weighs more first. <laughs> Uh, wood, wood. Plugs weigh 1.6. And this is point. Oh, it's because I have a ton of these. How much are each? God damn it, that doesn't help me at all. Alright. 
Ooh, I'm getting thirsty. Okay, so I'll go ahead and just use the newsprint. I'm at 100%. Oh, that's right. I updated my, my skill is really high, so of course it's going to light. So this is obviously another way that you can keep warm. And it takes god giggity damn forever. Dude, come on. Ugh. And if you hear the wind outside, it sounds like a storm is starting up. And if you're actually... Like night is coming. Oh god. And if you're actually outside, like if you're not in a protected area, um, when... When a storm starts, you are so fucked, dude. You, you're just straight up dead. You are straight up dead. Okay. I'll go ahead and add that. 50 minutes, one hour, two hours. All right, that'll give me time to fish. Oh, damn it, I have to break it again? All right. So I'll, yeah, here we go. I'll fish for two hours. Hopefully I'll actually get some food. Yeah, girl, I got food. I got a fishy fish. I like how I'm fishing for two hours and you only see me breathe twice. <laughs> okay, so I got one fish, um, which means I need to clean it. Oh, I'm getting tired and thirsty. Let me drink some water. God damn it, I love this game. I could play it forever. I could actually play it forever. Um, these guys weigh a lot, so I'll eat this. Okay, and that puts my hunger mostly good. Let's eat one more. Yeah, oh, and actually that's, that's a really interesting mechanic too. Um, when you're more tired, when your fatigue is higher, your uh, ability to carry stuff goes down, which is why, like, I think it's normally at 35 or something, but it keeps dropping. It's because I'm tired. Um, oh shit, the fire went out. Oh god. Let me start a fire. I don't have much wood left. If I fall asleep in my bedroll right here, am I gonna be safe? I don't know. Oh shit, I don't have a bedroll. <laughs> I'm super prepared. All right, well, I think that kind of gives you a good idea of what the game looks like um, and how it works. It's, it's a lot of this. It's trying to plan for the, um, oh my god, inevitable, <laughs> uh, terrifying freeze to death, starve to death, get attacked by wolves to death. Um, and it's really fun. It's really, really fun. And as soon as I'm finished recording, I'm probably going to die. Thanks for watching. As always, it's much appreciated. Uh, if you liked what you saw, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out my Twitter and Facebook. And y'all are awesome.